Okay, this is the zoom functions in Excel. It may seem very basic, but some people are using older versions or got bad habits or used to using the old versions so don't know these things exist. Um, if you go to the view section up on the top, you'll find that you got zoom and with the zoom you can adjust it to whatever size you want, you know, whatever scale, 75%. Want to look a bit closer, take it up to 200. Um, if you want it to 100%, just click on the button to the right of the zoom. And then you've got this zoom to selection. Zoom to selection is quite a handy one. Um, if you're doing tutoring, or maybe you've got formulas you want to have a look at, if you make a little box around the data uh, by holding the left button and then dropping it where you want it to stop, then just click zoom to selection. It zooms into that data you were looking at. Um, the advantage of this is it's very quick to look. So maybe you're checking formulas, maybe you're checking data to check that the uh, days off that these people have got are correct. Uh, whatever reason, it's very handy at all. I believe it was 2007, uh, they added the slider. I don't really use this much. Um, I find it's a bit awkward because it takes my mouse away from doing other tasks a lot faster so generally I don't rate that one and then you've got the most practical and fastest way of doing it which is holding the left control and use the mouse slide uh, you know the little button in the middle of your mouse you slide that up and down it will zoom in and out this is the fastest way I find it working um, using that combined with being able to just zoom to selection it's the fastest way of getting through the data Thanks for watching.